We have heard of airdrops of humanitarian aid and weapons and leaflets, but dead mice? Yep. In 2013, the U.S. Department of Agriculture's Animal and Plant Health Inspection Service organized an airdrop of thousands of dead mice laced with acetaminophen. That's the active ingredient in Tylenol. On the island of Guam, the goal was to kill the brown tree snakes that were causing severe ecological and economic damage by eating native bird species and small mammals. The reptiles are also adept at climbing power poles and electrical wires, and that results in blackouts. The mildly venomous snakes are generally just a few feet long, but they can grow to be more than 10 feet, and they have been known to bite children. Dead mice were chosen as the anti-snake weapon. They were injected with acetaminophen, which curiously is toxic to snakes, but relatively safe for other wildlife in small amounts. The mice were attached to small parachutes made from cardboard and tissue paper to ensure they got caught in the trees, where brown tree snakes tend to hunt. The snakes were accidentally introduced to Guam, likely as stowaways in military cargo shipments from the South Pacific, particularly from the Solomon Islands during or shortly after World War II. Native to Australia, Papua New Guinea, and surrounding islands, the snakes found an environment in Guam with abundant prey and no natural predators, allowing their population to explode. There was also concern that the snakes would spread to Hawaii. The possibility of snakes on a plane terrified Hawaiians. The proliferation of the snakes prompted scientists at the USDA's National Wildlife Research Center to search for snake-specific poison. They tested various compounds, including pesticides and common pharmaceuticals, trying to find one that was lethal to the snakes but had minimal risk to other wildlife. The winner was acetaminophen. Even in small amounts, oh, about 80 milligrams per snake, uh, were lethal within hours of consuming treated bait. Turns out that the brown tree snake lacks the necessary enzyme to detoxify acetaminophen. After proving effective in lab studies, scientists tested acetaminophen-laced bait in controlled outdoor environments, and when uh, these proved successful, they decided on the mouse drop. The solution to the snake headache, fittingly enough, turned out to be acetaminophen, a drug commonly used to treat human headaches. That for today is our Cup of Joe.